Interested in renting out your home or duplex for a few weeks at a time? You now have to register with the city of Austin, hand over some cash, and follow a set of rules. Good evening. I'm Robert Hadlock. And I'm Leslie Rohde. The city council passed that ordinance last night, but there are still a lot of unanswered questions, and those rules take effect in just two months. So what do homeowners and the city need to know about it? KXAN's Erin Cargyle went in-depth to find out. She joins us live in South Austin with more. Erin. Good evening, Leslie and Robert. The city believes there are at least 1,500 short-term rentals across the city right now. One-third of those are right here in the 708704 zip code. Now, the people already doing it will get first crack at registering with the city come October 1st, but the city still has a lot of work to do before then. It's a done deal. There are now strings attached to renting out your home or duplex for a few days at a time in Austin. But the city still has a lot to figure out. We have to create a form, we have to create a fee, we have to create a process for people to register. They still don't know which department will handle the registration process. The city council wants staff to spend the first three months registering property owners already operating short-term rentals, then open it up for others. And rules still have to be written, which the code compliance department will have to enforce. Those who fought this from the start are skeptical inspectors will be able to keep up. The regulations will only be as good as the city's commitment to enforce them. After a balcony collapse at an East Austin apartment complex four months ago, the code department made it clear they needed more manpower to keep up with the daily demand. How oh, do you think this is going to be too much? Um, it's hard to say at this point. I know that in the city manager's budget that came out earlier this week, there's a proposal for adding 19 more inspectors to the code compliance department. The city will also take time to figure out if they need to add other employees to handle the rest of the process and say the new registration fee short-term rental owners will have to pay will help cover those positions. The city is still trying to come up with that figure, too. Critics predict all of the unknowns are a recipe for disaster. The city definitely should have taken more time to do this. But the city says just give them time to get a smooth process in place. And we'll get the word out to you when registration opens. The city says sit tight for now while they get these new systems in place. Now, these new rules will not apply to condos or apartments. Live in South Austin tonight, Aaron Cargyle, KXAN News.